Hey, Chef Guy here. So, you know, we all love a great fried chicken, but between the white flour, breadcrumbs made out of white bread, and 10% of the frying canola oil actually staying with the breading, who wants to take the risk? Fried chicken just isn't for weight loss. Unless, of course, we end up hacking it. So let me show you my technique. You just saw me seasoning some chicken breast, and now I'm whisking three eggs, one for each chicken breast. I'm also going to season the eggs with salt, cayenne pepper, and quite a lot of paprika because that makes it very tasty. Let me whisk the eggs again. Then I do a double dipping, if you will. I put the first breast in the eggs, then in the coconut flour. Yes, coconut. Then back into the eggs and then into my special breading. And I'll tell you more about that breading in just a minute. But then the breast is ready to be cooked. So how do I hack fried chicken? Well, first you notice that instead of white flour, I'm using coconut flour right here. Coconut flour is fiber packed and fat burning. Then instead of breadcrumbs, I make my own crumbs by processing healthy organic cereals, such, such as Ezekiel's, for example, into a food processor until they look like breadcrumbs. You probably have some, uh, some of the cereals uh, at your normal store. So the, the key here is to get rid of the white flour and breadcrumbs and replace them by coconut flour and cereal crumbs. Also remember to walk very neatly, passing the chicken from one container to the other just like I'm doing. Next, instead of frying chicken in three inches of canola oil, I use an extra virgin olive oil spray. I almost never cook with that, but it does the job here. So I'm going to start by spraying the top side of the chicken breast, and then lay that side down. Two, and then three chickens. And of course, I'm going to spray the top. My chicken breasts are ready now. And all I need to do is uh, to bake them in the oven at 350 degrees for about 15 minutes until they are golden brown in color and cooked through. Look at these babies. This is how they turn out. After about 15 minutes, they're crispy golden, and they look very appetizing. Nobody can tell the difference.